Research, it's all around us. We use research every day without even thinking about it. How do you use research? So hand washing, it's one of those things that we do every day. Why do we do it? We do it not just every day, but many times a day. And I think the big reason is to reduce the amount of germs on our hands so we don't infect ourselves and we don't infect others. So how do we know that? I mean, this is like science playing out in our lives. How, how do we know it works? We, well, we know that from even 150 years ago when there was a gentleman in Europe, uh, Semmelweis, who was a physician and he was a very keen observer of what was going on around him. And he also listened to his patients. So what was really neat about this story is there were two hospitals that he was involved with um, where women had babies. And one hospital, the midwife, midwife nurses delivered the babies, and in the other hospital, the medical students and the physicians delivered babies. And what the patients knew is they wanted to deliver at the hospital where the midwives delivered them because they had a much lower risk of getting an infection and getting very sick, and their babies getting very sick. So he listened, he thought, he watched, and he realized what was happening is the physicians and the medical students were coming from doing autopsies on patients who died from infections. So what he instituted was that everybody had to wash their hands and they actually dramatically reduced the infection rates at this other hospital. So he was the first to do that and since then there have been many, many others looking at this and studying it and showing that it works. So you were a kid that always washed your hands, thanks mom and dad, right? <laughs> That's right. Now you're a health researcher, a professor, studying this stuff. Yeah, well, it's, I feel like it's come full circle. Um, what, what I've been looking at is trying to think outside the box because we know it's a relatively simple thing to do, to wash your hands, but we also know that compliance rates or people actually doing that, they're quite low and we're not really sure why that is. So we know hand washing is important. How important is it? It is the most important way to prevent the transmission of infections. So this is a simple act that we can do, mm -hmm. science-informed, research-informed, that can have a real impact. That's right.